in this video we can learn the machine independent feature expressions introduction absolute expressions relative expressions neither absolute nor relative handling the type of expressions in assembly language instructions we know that it has three parts labels opcode and then operand this operand is a value or an address so this operand value can be an expression that is assemblers also allow use of expressions in place of operands so what is meant by an expression expression means you will have some variables and you will have some operators connecting those variables for example a plus b is an expression what is an equation if there is an equal to symbol then it will be an equation a plus b equal to 5 that is an equation just a plus b means it's an expression so in assembly language instructions instead of giving operands as direct values we can give expressions arithmetic expressions are formed according to the normal rules using arithmetic operators plus minus char and divided by in an expression the individual terms may be constants user defined symbols or special terms for example consider the expression a plus b the individual term in this expression a plus b that is a and b they are variables that is user defined symbols for example another expression a plus 1 in that individual one term the a plus a and 1 the 1 is a constant and the individual terms can also be special terms the only special term used here is a star symbol star we know that it denotes the current value of the location counter so the, see this expression puff and equ star which means equ we have learned that is used for equating which means buff and equal to the current value of location counter this assigns a value to buff and which is the address of the next byte following the buffer area some values in the object program are relative to the beginning of the program and some values do not depend on the starting address of the program so according to this this expressions are classified as absolute expression which gives a constant value or relative expression which depends on the location of the program starting location of the program then neither absolute nor relative that means it's not a proper expression it's an error depending on the type of the value they produce absolute expressions absolute means constant if the value of an expression once evaluated if we get a constant then that expression is an absolute expression if the value of the expressions we evaluate then we get a variable value then it is not an absolute expression it is called a relative expression so absolute expression can be a the expression which contains only absolute terms for example see this expression max le max len see this instruction max len eq 1000 so here the operand value is a constant so it is can understand that it's an absolute expression but absolute expressions may also contain relative term relative term means variables provided the relative terms occur in pairs with opposite signs for each pair see this example max len eq buff and minus buffer so here buff and and buffer are relative or they are variables but they occur in pairs and with opposite sign this is positive sign this is negative sign so this becomes and the expression becomes an absolute expression which means the expression the value of the expression is a constant for example buffer is having one address and buffer is having another address so the difference will give a constant value none of the relative terms enter into multiplication or division and one more condition is these relative terms there should not be any multiplication or division in the expression that is also one more condition relative expressions in relative expressions all the relative terms relative terms means we can consider it as variable terms variables except one can be paired and the unpaired relative term must have a positive sign so the expression becomes a relative expression for example consider this one tab eq so this is the expression operand value op tab plus buff and minus buffer so here constant values are not there all are relative va values or variables 
so octave plus buffon minus buffon so here we can see that all the relative terms except one can be paired so this two can be paired and this stands out and the remaining unpaired relative term must have a positive sign so this remaining term has which is octave that has a positive sign so this becomes an absolute value buffer minus buffer this becomes an absolute value and this is a variable value so the expression becomes a relative expression none of the relative terms must enter into multiplication or division a relative term represents some location within the program neither absolute nor relative these are actually invalid expressions expressions that are legal are those expressions whose value remains meaningful when the program is relocated expressions that do not meet the conditions for either absolute or relative are neither absolute nor relative so third category is neither absolute nor relative so these are considered as errors examples are buffer plus buffer 100 minus buffer 3 star buffer etc so how this becomes errors for example if you consider the multiplication 3 star buffer so according to the value of the buffer the 3 star buffer will be having a higher value sometimes if the buffer has a large memory address then 3 into buffer will be having a even more larger memory address which which may not exist also so this can become an invalid expression buffer plus buffer also an invalid expression 100 minus buffer also invalid expression so invalid expressions the category is known as neither absolute nor relative handling the type of expressions to find the type of the expression we must know or keep track the type of the symbols used in that expressions so to define the type we can or keep track the type we can give include that as a column in the symbol table symbol table we know that it contains symbols and values with that one more column we can include with the type of the symbol for example ret adr is a relative it's a relative term then buffer is a relative term buffer is a relative term max len is an absolute term so this type also can be included in the symbol table from this topic the questions can be asked like we will be given some expressions and to find out or classify whether they are absolute relative or neither absolute nor relative Thank you everyone.